before I joined the group, and before the mothers, uh, Frank had a little studio. Uh, and uh, I think at one point he recorded this guy and a girl breathing hard like they were having sex or something. So one day Frank was going home and the cops stopped him and they said, oh, what are those tapes? And, and he must have acted guilty or something. So they, they took him to the station and played the tapes and, and they, oh, this is porno. So they, they locked him up in jail. Now ever since that time, Zappa now, when he could afford to, he, he wouldn't even drive a car because he was so paranoid of going to jail. And he would not, never take drugs or never own any drugs at all. And when other people offered them, I think twice he smoked a, a joint or something like that and didn't like it at all. Uh, and so he, he kind of had... Uh, Well, not in the first group, we, we, we never discussed it. People would do things, and, uh, and Zappa tolerated it to a certain point. But when he got a little bit more power, uh, well, when Flo and Eddie joined the group, they, they said, okay, look, Zappa, we're going to smoke grass, whether you like it or not. If, if you want us in the group, you have to let us in the group, knowing that we're going to smoke grass. Uh, okay, so that was that group. The next group, Zappa was the leader of the band. He was paying everybody as sidemen, and, and it was like, uh, that's the way it is, and, and you, you don't do drugs. Because he, he learned, uh, by this time, he, he had a lot more power. He, he knew that he could tell people, you know, he could make di dictates to the band. Because when we joined the band, they were just getting started. You can't tell everybody what to do then. You know what I mean? But but in 74 on, and especially like in the 80s, uh, or late 70s, oh, you couldn't do anything. And people were getting fired because they smoked a joint or something like that, you know. Uh, well, I personally could do it. I couldn't, you know, I, I, I mean, it would affect the music I in an adverse way. Because, first of all, I was playing all my parts from memory. And when you do something like grass, uh, it affects your memory, you know. You get too excited, you, then you, you lose it, you know. So I couldn't do it. And other people, uh, I don't know, it wasn't as crucial to them, maybe. Uh, uh, like Jimmy, uh, I don't know if he, I mean, he, Jimmy would drink tons of beer you know, every night. I mean, Zappa never complained about that, you know, but. And we knew he was drinking tons of beer because there'd be a, like a puddle about an inch deep below the drum seat. <laughs> <laughs> Just sweat coming off of him. <laughs>